What's up guys, it's Brian again from Lake Hickory Scuba Marina. Back out here at one of our local golf courses. Uh, the water pump that you guys saw us install, we're actually going back out to clean the grate on it. Um, and we've got to do a little bit of surveying for the owner here at the golf course. Uh, basically, they want to see the condition of the water pump, how it sets and all that. So that's what we're out here doing today. Um, we've got to remember how to get into the entrance here, but basically we're just going to go out. I'm going to film for the owner and then clean, do a little bit of cleaning around the grate for them. And then I'll give them the footage and that way they can kind of go in and do an evaluation on it. But I wanted to bring you back here just to show you how things change. We were just out here about two weeks ago and I want to show you how conditions can, can change very rapidly, especially where they're actually sucking up the, uh, the water at. But if you'll turn and look here, this is what we're dealing with. We've got to go across this little bridge here, which is pretty cool. But here in a minute, we're going to pan the camera down to the water and the conditions of the water has actually got worse simply because we've had a lot more rain. So we're gonna be dealing, and no, actually I lied to you, it looks like the water's gonna be a little bit clearer for us. So that's actually a good thing. We got a little bit stronger current than normal, but that's gonna be good. It, hopefully it'll help keep the visibility good for us. But uh, looks like their waterfall is not working the way it was when we left. So maybe hopefully cleaning the grates and stuff for them will, will get it done. But there you can see the waterfall. Actually, you can see some ice frozen on it. That's pretty cool. But we're going to head down here. We're going to jump in and see if we can get it taken care of for them.
All right, guys, so I just got finished up. Um, wasn't too terrible of a job. I didn't really do that much cleaning. The grates were pretty clean. There was a little bit of sand up into them that I couldn't get out without taking the grate off itself. But my main goal today was to go out, survey exactly what we installed for them, get some footage for them, let them see what it looks like. So I did that. I did dig a little trough out uh, where it had kind of piled up the sand and dirt around the grate. So I did dig them out that trough. But now they've got a good idea of what it looks like. I'm gonna download the footage for them and then they can kind of take it for what it's worth and you know see how they wanna make the system even better for them. But I appreciate you coming along with us. And I just wanted to let you guys know too, when we install stuff like this, we actually go back out, we you know, we look at it, we investigate it, and we make sure that everything we did was good. So it's not like we just install something and we go and wait on them to call us again, but um, we always double check behind us to make sure what we did was good. But guys, I appreciate you coming along with me. If you like this video, definitely share it and hit that like button as well. As always, guys, make sure you follow us on Instagram and Twitter, like us on Facebook, pin us on Pinterest, subscribe to us here on YouTube. And as always, guys, we appreciate your business. Guys, we really appreciate you watching our videos. If you liked it, make sure to give us a big thumbs up. If you're not a subscriber, simply hit that subscriber button for us and make sure you hit the little bell to turn on all notifications. If you want to see some other cool videos, make sure to click these links here. They could be scuba tips, they could be diving videos, search and recover videos, or gear reviews. Once again, guys, we really appreciate it.